Still up on the way here. So we'll see how it goes. So we're not going to have a proper interview this. I'm hoping it's just a wee bit of information, that's all. If it's this long for a few weeks, I'll go and get it checked. The last thing I want is a wee niggle or injury. Point on training. So, we'll warm up without any wraps and stuff just now and then we'll go into it. So, yeah. Oh. Oh, my bar. Pete's not all the way back slightly. We'll go with 12 and then 60 we'll do 8. May as well do some more. Uh. 
And this is the last session of week two. Now we're going to week three after this, so training's going okay. I can't really complain, I can't really judge it just yet. My bench has been going well, I can at least say that. Scott Dallas is still going fine, so not much change in there. Oh, pardon me. I can't complain. Can I complain? And today will be quite fun. So 55 kilo shoulder press. I mean, not the heaviest I've done, but you know, we're getting into it again. Dumbbell rows, 40 for 8, that'll be fun. With the chin ups, 12 and a half. I'm doing the, for the chin ups very slowly, building up. And then I'm not doing any optional work, so it's fine. Knuckles, creaking and cracking. Arm looking good. Arm does not look good. Let's see what's going on. I'm saying that for my right arm was better there. No. No. But oh, in this camera lane, in my secondary camera is a bit off. Why is it so bright, this camera? So, how do we all the defaults? See, I just look lost. Who are that? Why? Oh, well. No, it's too late. Sorry. But see if I do this, it completely destroys the exposure. See? Maybe if I do this, that makes it even darker. Do that maybe? I don't know, don't know. This camera's just too fucking bright. This is just it. Can now. Can now. Ah. 
Uh, we'll do eight reps and sixty now. As I say, I've been doing a lot of weight work, well, so still working on it. Time is half over just now. Not too bad. Not too bad. What days am I training next week? So Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. Cool. Interesting for tomorrow, legs. That'll be fun. Uh, I might have to double check something on my phone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I don't know why I refresh this. There you go, that's the text. Oh, good. So we are doing thanks to you. Eight reps, so we'll just get them going. Yeah, I know a lot of you are like, well, you don't need a belt for I really don't, but it's just something I'm learning I've got used to. Then I said, I had to run, I used to give me 1%, then I've got a 3% boost. Night lines. Still got my sore wrist. I mean, it's not the worst, but it's still sore. Yeah, it's going fine. I, fi I finished work there at three, got in the house, kind of packed it for a wee. And I'm now doing a workout, so again, I've done work myself. Ah, uh, James, there we go. Good stuff. You gonna do some warm up sets first? Yeah. 
Here we go. So this is officially we're taking our three minutes and then we'll get into it. Oh. Just chill for a wee moment. I'm glad I'll be gander for streaming just now. George Santos, Lance Fitness, Zach Boss, Cole Vines, Foxy Zilla, Season Driving. Quite a few people, not gonna lie. Quite a few. Focus. Mm -hmm. Oh, fusion shot. There's the timer. Let's add go. So I just have my nose out of those pictures and stuff there. Just have my gander who's been on. So we're going for 80 cubes and as many reps as humanly, humanly possible. So we're going to be going through this. As I say, my wrist is a pen. I've been taking breath in the past then, so hopefully the swelling goes down over a period of time. And as long as I wrap my hands, then it should be okay. So we're going for, we'll try and go for 8 reps, right, but if I can get more, 
we will be happy. We will be happy. Okay, that's good. That's good. Are you ten minutes a day? I can't complain about that. No, I can't complain at all. That was a comfortable. I mean, I'll review it. How do I do that? Cool. Cool, cool. Point to shoulder press now, anyway. Oh, Good thing I just didn't let the bar go now. So what do you rate I do for bench? I would say I would do heavy fives. So see, I have to do a few do a few warm up sets. So do so your one minute max is night. So your one minute max right now is nine to five. So. I'd say do a set of 20, 40, 60. Just do 10, 10, 10. Get it, then reps done. And what I would do is put up 80 kilos or a weight that's quite, for at least five reps. So I'd probably do, do 20, 40, 60, 10, 10, 10, and do 80 kilos, five sets of five. Because if you want that max, it's about 90. No, 95, then it just means you're getting enough volume as well. Bye. Uh, go with that. And see if you think you do 80 and the five reps is first out far too easy. Then either just put a wee two and a half on. Okay. So basically five sets of 80 kilos for five reps. So 20, 40, 60. 10 reps, 10 reps, 10 reps, then do 8 kilos for 5 sets, 5 reps. So your total volume of reps should be 25, 55 reps of bench essentially. But you're doing 30 kilos as a warm up, you're, you know, you're doing 30 reps as a warm up, and you're doing 25 reps as working.
So. That's just kind of a wee guesstimate, as I say. If it's too heavy, bring the weight down. If it's too light, put the weight up slightly. And I'd do that for a few bench sessions. And then what you'll go for is maybe do five sets of three of 90 kilos. And then you do that. Then you do singles. So you do five sets of one of 95. And then you would attempt 100 kilo again. So, it's all about making a wee mini plan for your progression. Because you, you don't want a kind of yo-yo progression, whereas you progress one week, but you kind of plateau, and you progress, then you kind of don't progress. You want to always, every single session, build to your building blocks. And if you're not going to build, then maintain, but always change a, a, a slight variable. So, as I say, if I do 100 kilo for 10 reps, and then I go 105 kilo for 4 reps, I've progressed, I've lifted heavier weight for less reps, or you do 100 kilo for 5 reps, and then you do 100 kilo for 6 reps, you've still made a progression because you've lifted it one more time. That is good. So what? Uh, let's see. Eighty kilos. Give it a wee green bracket. We got ten. So, pardon me. No, let's just say, uh, so it's 10, 8, 6, okay. Watch me look at my board from my bench. So it's a wee gander. One. Two. Three. Four. Six, Fair enough, so that seems that the form looks fine, I don't know. So, yeah, we done all right. So it's 45, 50, 55 now. So let's get it done. So, uh, Ten, eight, six, ten, eight, six. Keep in the end of the Ten, eight, six. Bada bing, bada boom. Hey, bada bing, bada boom. Put this in the glass. Pardon me.
So it's the only reason I'm using the belt for shoulder press is it's kind of kind of comfy. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of comfy. I'm pretty sure I did do a word in there, but I kind of forgot lost count, so if in doubt, always do an extra. It's better to go over your bed than go under. I guess if you always go under, you're saving energy, but nah. Because you're either working hard or hardly working, so it's better to always work hard. Almost on to 60 kilo again. Good, good. I mean, I got my dumbbells up to, I want to say, 32 even at some point. Maybe even a wee 35 on another point. I mean, I'm just noisy and shit just now. So, didn't mind me. Oh, good. You know what? I should hold on. I want to check a wee some, some. So I did 30 for 10, 50 for 10, 60 for 10, 70 for 10. Ah, there you go. How many was 70 for 10? Yeah. So, see 70 for 10 reps on a scale of 1 to 10, how difficult it was. 10 being you couldn't have got another rep after 10, and 1 being this is fucking bitch weight. And then five being like, I could have maybe squeezed one or two. So bad. So we'll call that like, we'll call it like a level eight or nine you were at, okay? So, yeah, I'd probably say between 75 and 80 kilos, Five sets of five. I'd say it's a seven. Right. It just depends, I don't know. So I will do you know what you could do? Do you have like one point two five increments? Like you can do seventy five, seventy seven and a half and eighty. Do you have that by any chance? Yeah. I would say go for eighty for five sets of five. But if that is a big push, then maybe do 75 or 77 and a half. Or what you could do is all I have is two and a half. 
So you could do 75 and 80. Okay. So you could do three sets of 75, two sets of 80. You could do two sets of 75, three sets of 80. So you could, you could either do half and half and see how you get on, or you can go balls to the wall, all 75, all 80. It's really up to yourself, mate. Just go by how you feel. I'm not there. I can't even see. I can't even tell. So. Yeah. Go for it then. But remember, once you start at 80 kilos, you're not going back down. You'll be doing five sets of 80 or five reps. No, 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 no. It's called five by five. So it's five x five. Mm. Seventy five for five. So seventy five kilos for five reps by three. Then do it. Okay, we'll go with that. That's fine. What I said. So 75 kilos, five sets of three. Then you'll do 80 kilos, five reps for two. That's fine. I, I will allow it. Okay. I have allowed it. So five reps, X, two and three sets. Yes. Cool. Get it done. And each time you do a set, give it give it a grading from like one to ten. It's always good to judge your fatigue levels and stuff. Right, I'm going again as well, because I'm starting to chat too much. How about the proper fucking comes on the day? Right, let's do this. Eight reps. Good, good.
ויותר מהוגן לשפתם. חיים זה עברי, הוא ילד פה עם הנאנס, גוט גוט, הכי דייס, so let's just review the reps and stuff, cardinals and qualities. See, maybe one day I'll get up to the levels of having like 40 odd viewers out and they're going all that, they're quite good. Get more back on all that. As I say, I've still got a long way to go, I still need to make some stuff better with the streams and stuff. So, we're getting there. Plus, I don't take my top off. So, that's the second that's what I've never done that. But at some point, I might be getting into doing that, but I'm not exactly leaning off of any of that nonsense just yet. After all, I'm a powerlifter, so. Have to be reserved. Too much cardio. I can take my t-shirt off. Uh, what am I playing? I have to get a look at my form. So let's look at So let's look at my reps number 45. So that's how I count. So we did one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, I did all of them. Caught that. Cool. Let's count now. Let's look at the reps. We got one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Ah, easy. Cool. Good, good. So let's see. Chad's been knocking off there. Let's have a check. What's getting said? So. Two times seventy-five done. How was it? Five times, four times, once. Salmon and blue fish. I can fine. Got a pump and cause I'm built like cause I'm old. Fuck, I look weird. <laughs> no rubber gloves around. Like you're never gonna, you're never going to get any. I mean, I don't have the marigolds that you're wearing. I've got blue gloves. That is it. The ones that I had last time. Don't have any Mario Gold on this just now. First set easy, second set I don't know. Five, it was comfy. Right, so you've got, you, you're going to do one more 75, then you're going to do three sets of 80. It's up to you. What did you say? No, no. I've only, you know how the gloves last in the blue ones? I've only got maybe a pair of them, that is it, only one from work, that is it. I don't have, I, I didn't have them bought any uh, Mario Gold, as I say. If it's no worth my time, I'm not going to do it. Can you show me? You've seen a pair of blue gloves before. The little, it's just through there. And still, I'm in the middle of my workout just now, so. Hmm. Alright, we're going to do 55 kilos. And we're going to do hold on, 55 kilo, and we're going to do six reps. Uh, 
Veo por demás. The marigolds. Uh, oh. oh, man. Set three Philicos hover and below failure. There you go, you've, only, you've, you've got two more sets. Give yourself three to five minutes rest. Give yourself more rest. Right? Yeah. See for, see for strength building and power lifting, three to five minutes and sometimes even longer recovery. Body building anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute and a half. A minute and a half at the fucking extreme most. For me, my rest periods are between a minute and a half to three ish minutes. So I'm going to do my, my set now. See, I told you I don't rest long, but I. Bought, I but I definitely see that's the difference between bodybuilding and powerlifting. So it's good to do a bit of both. I would say, well, as you want to get stronger and hit the 100 kg bench, you'll need to give yourself a wee bit more rest for the muscles to build up the nervous system for strength. Whereas once you've got 100 kilos, you can do more bodybuilding stuff up to build up the refuge and stuff and the volume. Sam and King Nick. Done it. Good, good. Devil shoulders are getting stronger again. That's good. Oh. Oh, there we go. No, my best pose, but. There we go. Nothing much, good man. I'm just training away. I've got a wee injury in my wrist. It's just been a wee bit niggly. How's the stream going? It's going fine. Uh, I'm getting into doing my gaming streams a bit more, so I'm getting there with that. Apart from I fucked my audio in my last gaming stream, I played the game for three hours before I realised my gameplay audio wasn't recording. So, was just a little bit peed off. I made a wee YouTube shot of the moment I realised I had fucked my audio. 
I would pity him if it at Barnes and eternally by your side. Did you get all your reps, Lance? Or all your sets? Pardon me, apologies. What can I leave you? Right, I don't need this on. What are you saying? Doing eighty nine. There you go, man. Fingers crossed. See, the tricep's are looking kind of evenish now. Kind of. Right. <laughs> Let's uh, have a wee gander at the training program. There we go. So, complete. Good. I'm not really having any niggles with my wrist, but as I said, I'm not aggravating it. I'm just doing the bare minimum. So, two and a half, seven and a half, twelve and a half. So yeah, so that's what I'm doing to that. One down felt really good. Good, good. Again, three to five minutes, go again. And don't move up the weight, stick with 80, okay? Don't feel too ambitious. As I say, this is about building the strength. We're not going for any one-night maxes, you're doing the homework to achieve the test, right? And see the next session you're doing benching, do five sets of three. And what you can do then is do 80. Or even you can do 85 maybe. And then maybe a wee bit heavier. I moved the Jacobs higher because I noticed you can hold it at the rest up top longer. Yeah. Your strength. So you've got... Uh, Don't, don't you push your buttons? No, you'll, you'll notice that you've got three types of strength. You've got positive, static, and negative. So your positive strength is for bench, for example, pushing, for rowing, pulling. Anything that's positive is doing the motion at opposite of the, the weight. So, in position, positive is the strongest, right? The next strongest thing is your static, holding it out. And then your next strongest is your negative, bringing the bar down. So for true, I you probably see top the uh, com flats and stuff, doing stuff. It's like, for example, if you're doing like a leg extension stuff, what they'll do to begin with is like if you're, we'll say dumbbell set, if you're benching, you're doing, yeah, 
Go positive. Your positive is always the thing that's going to fail. So if you're benching, you're always going to fail trying to get the bar up. You're never really going to fail coming down. So that's why you see people in the machines. They will do the pushing. Once you can't do that, somebody will come and spot in and bring it up for them. And then they'll hold it. And then they'll bring it down. And then they'll hold it. And then they'll bring it down. And they'll keep doing that to destroy the muscle even further. But sometimes your static strength can be a bit weaker, so your static strength at the top may be very strong, but down here it might not be as strong. So I say in power lifting, you have to, so you here, you go bend, you go down, bench, rack. So a lot of people struggle from here, holding for that half a second, then bench. So some people just like to touch and go. Which I have been doing recently, but every now and then I'll hold it, then boom, straight up. Right, so it's all, it's all relative to what you're doing. So you're going to get the first set done, so I don't need to do this too tight, so. Well, she's nearly finished working in the next 10 minutes, so I'll be done my work at 10 sheets back. Happy days. Yeah. So. yeah, well, this is the last day. Good. God, the other chest is absolutely. But I think you could do a wee bit of both, so power building and body building. So when you do your you do your strength work to begin with, like you're doing, you see once you're done your strength work, when you rest three to five minutes, you do your bodybuilding work about thirty seconds to a minute and a half. You know me by now, I'll rest anywhere from a minute and a half to fucking fifteen minutes. Just depends how much fucking chatting I'm doing. So we'll switch the camera background. There we go. Ten reps. One, two, three, four, five, I just need to look, I, I just want to be, I just need to want to be larger. I've never looked good now, so looking good and clothing where it's at. Quite a model and all. As I was saying, hopefully, as I say, you, you just need to, as I say, your metabolism is too crazy, so you're always probably going to be lean. You won't be like myself where you're, you're thick, you're fuller, but you've got a wee bit of fat. Because I'm, I'm still trying to lose weight, and that's the same. I'm probably lighter than you. I'm about 76 and a half, but because of my height as well, I actually look pretty big. But I'm not really, I'm quite small. Yeah, like you, but with my shitty four pack. That's all I need. Hey, I've got I've got shit abs genetically. I seeing I was lean, my arms were alright. Slightly squint, but they look alright. If you look at my Instagram photos, I did have some alright abs. Like there's one photo of me, and I wasn't big, but it is by far my favourite photo of my physique.
Ah, could I wait for that? I was doing reps, like, ab, 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 ab. I wasn't even big at all. Hmm. Uh, she asked one thing I, I, I didn't take enough photos when I was in such a great shape. I'm not really a photo taking person. I've got the V lines, so I'm sorted. See, I've just got, I've got a blocky way, see, because of this, all my powerlifting and stuff and genetics. See, my shoulders are quite wide. But. My waist is quite blocky, that's why I need a large V taper to balance everything out. I just see a baby so young. See, I, I didn't get enough holes in myself when I was in good shape. Well, I felt like I took a lot, but I generally didn't. Yeah, I've went through pure ups and downs. I've went from being fucking an aesthetic god to then getting skinny as fuck for boxing and then building up and getting a lot thicker now. So I'm kind of in a middle zone just now, really. Right, let's get it, lads. Right, while you're doing that, I'll do my pull ups. So I'm going for eight kilos. As I said, someday we'll do a wee stream where I'll just go over like kind of old photos and videos of my training. Cover a bunch of old stuff. But I've got a bunch, I've got a few things. But it'll be, in, it'll be, in, it'll be interesting to show you. Oh. Right, eight reps. We're going for eight. Nothing more, nothing less. Give me Fuck. Thanks. I think I was eight. Hope I didn't look out. Cool. My nose is feeling pain. But I'm just trying to, I'm not doing any optional work just because I don't want to aggravate it just by doing something stupid. So, bare minimum, that is it. We'll do abs again at the end. <laughs> it's hard but it doesn't hurt. See strength building it doesn't it doesn't hurt the body building. Strength building's more your nerves and stuff. It's not it's not muscle. Because you'll have the muscle to push the weight. You just need to build up the, the tendons and the nerves systems, your central nervous system to be able to manage the weight. That is really it. 
So it's strength building? Yes, yeah, strength building, you need muscle. But it's all like uh, neurological and cerebral ner- uh, CNS, central nervous system, and in the tendons and stuff. Yeah. There you go. So, where I'm probably the opposite to you. My bodybuilding, like my, my mother chest, isn't the best bodybuilding style, but strength, I'm reasonable. I won't say I'm good, I'll say I'm reasonable. Like I got 80 kilo for 10 reps today, so I can't complain. See, that's what I'm saying. See when I did 115, not a single ounce of pain. I mean, I did go and vest in a pair of wraps and stuff. I mean, they don't need to be fancy. Anything that just causes compression does the job. Presented you. This is the lifestyle. You want to be able to prolong your exercise and fitness for as long as possible. Incline press, what would you recommend? See, my opinion is the incline press, you don't really, it's it's more bodybuilding work, it's not really strength building. So, I would just mainly stick to doing higher reps with that. But but I mean, when I mean higher reps, I mean between 8 and 12. Basically, your bodybuilding style, you're 8 to 12, and then just play about with the weights. There's no point in doing one net maxes for incline because that's how you end up with pe- pec health and shoulder injuries. So I would say exactly. So you've just got 80 kilo there. I would do the exact same again. Do your do your build ups. So do yeah, you said, what did you say, 30, 50, 60 or something, or 30, 40? What did you say, what did you say? Yeah, you did a 30, 50, 60. So, I would personally do 30, 40, 50, and then do like, or do 30, 40, 50, then you can do kind of, 55, 60, 60, 65. And you can do it within a range of 8 to 12 reps. There's no like a point for failure. It's just between 8 and 12 reps, do that and get a good pump going. And you can do sets like, you know what, you could do full range ones, you could do bottom halves to get more pump, you could do stop halfway, going up doing half rep, you can do. Because people say, oh, he's half repping. Yeah, that's if it's evil lifting. See if you're lifting a moderate weight and you're doing like half reps in the bottom. You know like 21s, where you do half, you do half, and then you do full. So you could, you could do that with edge. You could do half, you could do half, and then you could do full. And... That, I swear to you, for bodybuilding, that will put a fuck ton of blood in your muscles. So you could do like a 4, 4 and 4, the 12 reps, and you just do kind of a moderate weight. But as I say, you play a bit with stuff. You don't know until you spread out with different things and that. When it comes to bodybuilding, when it comes to form, as long as you're doing it safely, you're not too bald out of form or you need to do full range of motion reps. Not necessarily to get plenty of muscle into the blood. Yes, full range of reps will help, but sometimes you really just want to get the muscle pumped up. Doing that will pump it, but see if you're just doing lots of small reps or lots of hanging reps up there. That will pump up the chest more. Same with biceps as well. It'll pump up. It may not be best for strength, for strengthening the muscle, but for getting blood into it, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, that's it.
Pode ser sobre o sub. Right, we are doing two and a half kilos. This is the heaviest I've done so far. So let's just see how we get on. I mean, I'm hoping I do this no bother, but we don't know until we do it. <laughs> There we go. Oh, that's nearly pinched my nuts there. That's the last thing I want to do. Fucking hot last thing that happened. Right. I can't reach. Six reps. Some traps. I mean, I'll just walk with the way. I mean, I don't need to lunge it about. Here we are. Oh. Hello. You all right? I'm just gonna walk out. But all right. All right. Well, I was busy as fuck today. Yeah, well, I'm just getting a workout done, so I will be done by the time you get back. Oh. Yeah, this is very warm. Oh, right. Mm. right, is it okay if I love you and leave you? Okay. I'm going to jail. I'm going to leave you, bye. There you go, she's finished work, so we're getting this workout finished. I mean, I've not been the quickest that I've normally been. Normally, I can do a whole training session and be done. It's fine now, but yeah, it's what it is. But you know what's amazing? How, see, to begin with, when I did my chin ups, I was struggling in the beginning with 12 reps and stuff. See, now I can do 12 and a half kilos with six reps, no bother. 
it just shows you how when you don't do a certain exercise for a while, it's not that you're bad at it, you just need to get yourself back into it again. Like Anna said, I could do pull-ups with 40 kilos attached to me. One rep, but I'm pretty strong. Right, so let's just have a look at my workout again. So move the chin ups. Easy. Easy, yeah, as, as I said, I'm not doing anything extra, just good for my wrist. 25 for 10, 32 for 8, 40 for 8. So 40 kilos will be the heaviest I've done in a long time. And technically, to see if I'm using both the dumbbells, 42 and a half kilos is the heaviest I can go. But because I'm going single-handed, I can go heavier. So we'll see it in the next couple of weeks how heavy I will be able to go. That'll be fun. Yeah, that will be fun. So, rows. Rows, rows. So, before I get into it, I just want to review my pull ups. So, One, two, three, four, five, nice. I'm just looking at the offset as well. So I'm just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, five. There you go, my form's fucking juicy. Best form there is, I'd say. That's it. Sorry, I know I'm seeing look at my form, I'm like real peeling. Right. Right, so just a stupid wee warm up set with this. No clock I'm about to change the camera, it's just just a wee stupid warm up, so it's just one, two, three, four, five, six, nine. So, so three, four. That makes forty kilograms. No, I mean twenty five kilograms. That was four, yeah, that's only she. And I suppose. Right, the camera over. Um, as, I, as I say, if anyone's got any questions about it, yeah, feel free to fire in. I'm pretty open, so no fear of any question. Apart from like, what's my fear? When I fear that, I'm sure I'll take a list. I'm just talking shit, I'm actually talking spouting. 
Oh, it's online, so it's just now. I think it's the heat. I may be going a bit hot heated, or she isn't it? A bit delirious. 10 reps, let's go. And because this is so light, we'll just try and, you know, form it. Uh, uh, and she's just asking how she gets rid of her garden and that table chair. Because you want to see the chair What's she going to get rid of? Why no, because we're not buying any just now. Ah, that's right. Yeah, I'm just saying that. But we've got nothing like that just now, so. That's right. Right, love and leave you. Bye bye. I know, Lance, that is the best. Do you know what? No, I don't know. With it, I don't know. Would it be a, a music copyright? That is a song by an artist, and I say, bring Sally up, you do a push up, bring Sally down. And I say, I could do that with abs. I could kind of. Do it like a plank, but almost as such. But I don't know. Maybe we'll do push ups. Well, that's it. They're doing chest. Uh, Moby. It's called Moby Flower. And that's the song Bring Sally Up, Bring Sally Down, Lift and Squat, Got to Tear It to the Ground. That'll be a push up finisher. When I'm doing abs, you can do that. That's it. I used to be quite good at it, but I'm pure shit at it. Look at my pump. Right, send it out. I'm going to do my next set. So, 32 and a half. Now it is. Is it? Aye. Give me a second and I'll have a big gander. <clears throat> oh, then we over my ankle. That would not have been good. What are you saying? I mean, what is he? Hmm. There you go, man. That's it. Chest is popping. Exhale shot. There you go. Exhale shot. There you fucking go. That is it. See, I'm too short to wear exhale in lavages and stuff. Like, the thing I've got to see for powerlifting. I, I wear a large t-shirt just for comfort, but I see when I wear a large, in large, it just becomes a fucking dress in me. Right. Let's do a set, because I kind of, you know, Procrastinated a wee bit there. So we're doing eight reps, I want to say. Eight. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. 
Agora que aí quando eu parei, não vou dar nem no outro novo. Se eu já tinha tempo, eu não posso dizer isso. Aí eu sei, o objeto que está ficando bom é mais o light e os ângulos. Isso é por isso que eu não gosto dessa câmera, eu gosto dessa câmera. We are doing some good boy. Big ball. Sound in high school breeze. The workout, eh? I'd say it's going pretty, pretty all right. Oi, that's it. It's going good. What is going good? Yeah, I'm the height of the camera. Exactly, because if you have a camera down there, it'd just be like, you know, like, scoop. Hi, oh, guys. Uh, you know, it was like, scoop, it has, it has a camera down there, so I'll just fucking chest titties. <laughs> I was loading a little bit of tea instead of the letter of the reels. Just be like. There you go, fucking we are close there. Boom. Right, how many reps am I doing? How many reps? Para bem, para bom, escadores. I mean, this is the, it's kind of an old one, it's kind of, it hits that, or it's like that, and it's like that kind of pose. But you can, you can kind of reach out as well, and you get the chest up, or you go like that. I used to be good at posing, no as much now. You have to get the legs in as well. Dynamic stance. Right. You're nearly there, and you'll be done with me talking my shite. Oh. Getting there. See? I look kind of small in that camera now. Just because my posture. But I'll uh, correct it. Put the lats in, tilt slightly. See the triceps, bang. That's it. As I said, I've still got a wee bit, I've got a good wee chunk of fat to go in my body. Um, as I said, I'm hoping once I get all the fat out of my body, I can be under 74, but hopefully bench just as much. Because if I can get as, as lean as I physically can, but still be pretty strong, then I should have a good frame of muscle again. But we'll see. We will see. Right, let's do this. Let's do this. So, so 
So we're doing 40 kilos. 40. About four and oh. 40, 40, 40. 40, 40. 40 kilograms. Holy moly. Let's do this. Yeah. Good form, I'd say. I'd say it was pretty damn good. Now, let's get another good reps. There we go. Oh, that's the other one's high up. <laughs> Go Habs. Habs time. Oh, that was the hand of the As Loki started to sweat it. There we go. Abs time. So, let's get the camera tilted down a bit more. What are we doing? What are we doing? What? What am I doing? What am I doing? Abs. Come on. What exercises will I do? Uh, I say with the leg raises. I say sizzles and crunches. Oh. Warm up. Let's get this. Oh. Uh, round one. Two. 
Rest. My back's fucking killing me. I'm all just tired and stuff, there's no pain. Well, round two. <laughs> Two. I'm fucking this to me, it's good. Uh, one more. Come on, round three, last round. Oh, these pores will help. Oh. 
Oh, I know it's my stretch. Day sucks. Uh, I don't even stretch anymore, to be honest. I should, but I just can't be honest. Like, I feel like when I'm working out, I can kind of see it. I'm either doing abs or I'm doing stretching. Yeah, I tend to always end up neglecting one or the other. But oh, that's me done today. Fucking sweltered. Absolutely sweltered. So good workout. Uh, as I say, if I quickly just show you. Hold on. All green. All green, and if we look at uh, the well, if we look at the week one, green, couple of wee reds, one red, green, few wee reds, and if we look at week two, not one red, so we've done well. So week three is we're doing so Tuesday, tomorrow we're doing squatting, decent weight, decent reps, and uh, same with deadlift. My bench, we're now up in the bench weight, which will be good. Squat as well. There you go. Sunday, I'll be up at 90 for four to six reps. So that'll be interesting. So, yeah. That is, this is week number three that we're doing. So interesting, isn't it? Definitely interesting. But yeah, that's just done. So... If you've stuck on and watched the training, much appreciated. If this has helped you in any way or motivated you in any way, awesome. I know I'm feeling a wee bit deflated and I'm not as ecstatic as I normally am, but it's good, it's good, good. So, I don't really say that. Uh, last person to follow me, WSXE123. WSXE123. Appreciate the follow. That is awesome of you. So, I am going to love these and leave these and I shall see you all tomorrow.